poor nutrition in the womb and during the first days of life can be damaging to the developing brains of newborns. A recent study examined the consequence of this damage in infants with very low birth weight over the first four years of life. The study, published in Volume 127, Issue 4 of the British Journal of Nutrition, is the journal's 2021 paper of the year and comes from Jose Uberos and co-workers from San Cecilio Clinical Hospital in Granada, Spain. The team examined records for more than 300 infants born between 2008 and 2017. The majority recorded a normal birth weight. About one-fifth weighted less than one and a half kilograms at birth and were considered to have been affected by intrauterine growth restriction. The energy intake for these infants was below the 25th percentile for newborns and equivalent to about 60% of the recommended value during the first week of life. Regression analysis of test scores measuring psychomotor and sensory development reveal significant differences between the two groups of children. 35.6% of neonates with intrauterine growth restriction show mild cognitive delay versus 24% of those with an appropriate birth weight. Intrauterine growth restriction was also significantly associated with behavioral disorder and delayed cognitive development. An energy restriction during the first week of life was significantly associated with visual deficiency and cerebral palsy, a group of disorders that affect motion, balance, and posture. Although the retrospective nature of the study is an important limitation, the findings offer valuable support for further research. Understanding how energy and food intake affect neurodevelopment early in life could offer some guidance in managing situations in which such intake is low, starting in the womb.